afternoon. My name is Dave Edwards. It's my honour, indeed, my very, very great pleasure to be your MC for this, the Marquis in the Park celebration. Now, I know there are one of you, or two of you, interested in football. I've just hot-footed it from McKessick Park, where the final score finished. Rothes 3, Fraserburgh 0. And up the road at Wick, it was Wick Academy 2 for Martin United 2. But of course we are not interested in the lower teams in Heinle football. <laughs> Apart from Turf United, Brian Thompson, and Charlie Charlesworth, manager at Lossiemouth. Lovely to see you, Charlie. It's a great delight to see you. Charlie, banned from a dugout, of course, at the moment, and just to make you feel welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Father of Martin Charlesworth, lovely to see you, Charlie. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready to rock? Let's go for it then! Your night really is going to be good. Be a good night. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the Bucket Thistle Highland League Championship winning squad!
together and welcome a man who's had the vision to not only put this whole thing together, but to lead the Bucky Thistle from the front for the last eight years. Your club president, Mr. Mark Duncan! a lot of time to put the speech together which has been really, really busy the last three weeks, but good afternoon ladies and gentlemen and let me welcome you all to this afternoon's Marky in the Park event. Um, it's a special event to celebrate Bucket Thistle winning the Highland League for the first time in 52 years. Fantastic achievement. Um, and uh, as you're all aware, three weeks ago we went to Wick, um, which is a very tough game to go to, and we, we beat Wick 3 0. The team played absolutely fantastic, the support was out of this world. And um, at the end of the match, I think there was a lot of emotion with a lot of people, because a lot of people hadn't seen Bucky win the league before. Some people, unfortunately, their whole life never seen Bucky win the league, so it was a big thing. Um, the celebrations when they came back to Bucky were fantastic. And really, it's continued in the last few weeks. Um, what about tears to go along and take a look at the shop windows in Bucky and see that just about every business in the town has is, is, um, got a display up about the club. And uh, it's just fantastic. But it really emphasised, I think, that the, the Fabric Club is at the heartbeat of the community and it's never been better demonstrated than it has been in the last few weeks. Um, I just want to thank you all for coming here tonight and helping to support the club again. Um, without your support, nights like this wouldn't have happened. And uh, I hope you are here a great night, and uh, you'll maybe hear from me a bit later on. But thank you all for coming. Ladies and gentlemen, Club President, Mark Duncan!